In this video, I'm going to be ranking every single game mode from the Minecraft tier list. Alright, so starting off first, we have Crystal PvP. I'm going to be rating these game modes by how fun they are on their own and in no other way. So Crystal PvP is a pretty fun game mode, um, but it can be aggravating at times. It's also very pain dependent, uh, specifically for low pain. I, I did hate Crystal PvP for a while, but when I'm not forced to play it for a tier, I don't really care. Um, I'm gonna give it B tier because I never play Crystal, to be honest. After I got low tier 3, I completely quit, uh, cause the game mode itself is just boring to me, and it's not gonna help in any of these game modes, so. It's not that helpful, but if you have fun playing it, then that's okay. Next up is Sword PvP. Now, Sword PvP is a base game mode. Um, it's honestly not that fun, to be honest. Um, it's kind of a chill game mode, though. I do think it's better than Crystal PvP. And, you know, I mean, it's only a sword and diamond armor, so I think A tier, you know, it's a solid game mode, it's fine. UHC, this is gonna be the first hot take, I'm gonna put UHC in S tier. UHC for me is a game mode, I'm like, it's, it's just hard for me to get good at UHC, but I love UHC, it's super fun. The fact that there's no natural regen is also really interesting, I used to hate it, but now when I play kits that don't have the natural regen, um, I'm a lot better. And also, people who play UHC kit with natural regen, it's just ridiculous, bro. That, that kit needs no natural regen, to be honest. S tier. Next up is Diamond Pot. Um, to be honest, Diamond Pot, I'm not sure of. I think I'm probably going to go A or S tier. But just because Diamond Pot, I now only play um, for high tier 3. And I haven't been having fun with it for a little while now. I've actually just only played it so I could be better. For the uh, high tier three um i'm gonna put it in a tier but i'm gonna put it in front of sword because i do like pot more than sword next up is neth pot i think neth pot is like a super solid b tier and i'm gonna put it in front of crystal pvp to be honest i don't think i played neth pot for longer than like two hours since i got tier tested um neth pot to me nowadays is just super boring um but it, it was fun when I did start playing it, and when I do play it now, I mean, I'm still the same skill level at it. It's a game where you really don't lose your skill in, which I guess is kind of cool. Um, but I think it's like a solid B tier. Next up is SMP PvP. Um, I am a tester in SMP, but to be honest, SMP is a super boring game mode. I honestly think it is the worst game mode out of every single game mode I've ranked so far, so I am going to put it in C tier. SMP is like a super necessary game mode, I mean it's going to make you better at everything else, so I don't know, but in my personal opinion it's not fun, so I'm going to keep it in C tier. The final game mode is Axe, and honestly, I'm not sure to be honest. Axe is uh... Axe is kind of a weird one. I don't know. It, it Let me just rank it based on if it's fun or not. Um, Axe is kind of fun. I mean, it's okay. I think I'm going to put it in front of Crystal, but behind Nethpot and in B tier. I feel like... I feel like that's a good tier. I think it's a pretty solid tier list. You can probably notice from this, I don't really like shield game modes that much. And to be honest... UHC is just the perfect shield game mode. I mean, you don't really need X or SMP. I feel like UHC is like a perfect combination of both of them that they're both just not necessary. But I mean, that's just my opinion. Anyway, if you think I had any hot takes, which you probably disagree with this entire tier list, um, you can tell me in the comments below. Uh, I will be listing this tier list also in the description. So yeah, 